thank you. Come down, come on. Come, on. Should come downstairs. Morning. How was your sleep? <laughs> so, so funny. Hang on, let me get you in focus. Oh, she looks so cute. Well, we don't see quite much, so I'm going to save you this moment. <laughs> How was your sleep? Go on then, down you go. Woke you up for once instead of you woke me up. Look at this day. Literally looks like we're in a horror film. Actually, it doesn't look too bad. This We also still have the tree, which I'm really embarrassed about now, but it's going to go. Let me just show you. It literally looks like a horror film. And please excuse my hair. This is just woke up. I couldn't be bothered to do anything. Me. <laughs> Look at this. Horror film. Foggy as heck. Anyway, good morning everyone. It's Wednesday today and today, what's happening today? I'm trying to think what we're doing. Um, Oh, it's launch day for my In The Style Winter Collection. But we've got quite a nice home day. Monday and Tuesday, I had quite a lot of work to catch up on after Prague. And then tomorrow and Friday, I'm in London for a lot of meetings and events. So today's quite a nice chilled out home day. And I thought that it would be nice to start my video today. Although I think I might bring you, I might film over the next few days, maybe. I'll see how we go. I'm very tired. I've literally just woken up, rolled out of bed, decided to chat to you, so the throat's a bit dodge, the hair's a bit dodge, and the brain's a bit foggy still. <laughs> I think I'm going to make myself a coffee, and I'm going to make myself a bowl of Cheerios, because I'm really enjoying Cheerios at the moment again. It's just really nice and quick, and I just like it sometimes, so let's grab them, love them. If you haven't tried Cheerios, do they have them everywhere, or is it just a UK thing? I wonder. Do you have these in your country if you're not from the UK? Do America have these or do they call them something else? Don't know. I always find that very interesting with cereal. Coffee and Cheerios are ready. I'm actually doing some editing as well. <laughs> I've been literally avoiding editing this video because I was so nervous. So this is the video that you probably will have seen just before this video, which me and Bri filmed in Prague. So it was like a tipsy <laughs> girl talk, which turned out to be a very very tipsy girl talk so i couldn't actually fully remember exactly what we'd said like near the end of the video i was quite nervous to edit it seems okay so far <laughs> i've also got um bug's life on in the background because i love it anyone else love this film look at it i'm sure you'll have seen this one it's so good and i also just wanted to show you this dressing gown that i'm wearing because it's literally like a bathrobe now got me this for christmas from the white company very good christmas present i have to say but it's so good because it's literally like the longest dressing gown i've ever owned and i feel very bougie in it it's very hotel luxury-esque isn't it look who decided to get up this morning mm. hey booby are you snuggling daddy in bed mm. Oh, you're so cute. Look at that squishy head. She was sad in the night. She wasn't allowed in the bed. I know. She was keeping me up and then she was crying in her basket next to me. So she came back in. Didn't you, you big sucker? Okay, jump ahead a few hours. I'm now dressed. I've just popped on this gym outfit, which I love. This is a new one from Gymshark. So um, this is, <laughs> I'm doing this really badly, but this is the camo set. It's their new lilac one. To me, it looks more gray. I think it's one of those things, you know, when you see that on Twitter, where it's like, what color do you think this dress is? Brown or gold? Or that's probably not. No, it was blue or gold, wasn't it? Have you seen that? bit trippy but um i think this is gray but apparently it's lilac but it's so nice let me just take this off i love it so i'm wearing that today and i'm also wearing my new in the style coat which launches today and i'm so excited um it's just the best coat if you just want to get cozy and warm i love it so yeah that's my outfit that's my outfit <laughs> I'm about to head out and do some upper body today actually and some Stairmaster but funny story in the vlog where just before I left for Prague I filmed my leg workout it was a, a really quick but effective leg workout and I really wanted to share it with you but I completely forgot to say in the vlog that I did it so I think what I'm gonna do is put it in here now I need to film something else at the gym today for something else so I think it'll just be easier and I think it was a good workout so I want you to see it so I shall pop that in after I finish this chat Niall's currently vlogging too <laughs> we're double vlogging today 
and then the second leg day. And what you can do for the upper... <laughs> Tips with the nail. <laughs> Double vlogging! Double vlogging. Right, right, right. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just go see Blue while we wait. Oh, my little Blue Bee, are we going to go for a walk after? Do you want to go for a walk? When we're back from the gym, we're going to be quick, I promise. It's just the quick Stairmaster and shoulder day today with a bit of arms on top. I've also had to plaster this nail because it's very sadly snapped. My cute little butterfly nails. Ooh, while we're waiting, I'm going to show you the inspo for my next nails because I'm getting really into my nail art again. I don't know what it is, I just love snazzing up my nails. So I've got a bit of option. I was thinking this because it's going to be Valentine's Day soon. Nope, camera, don't want to show them. Well, I do. Hang on. I was just browsing on Pinterest and saw these, thought they were really cute. And then the other ones, which I love, which I might do after them, are these. How cute are they? And I might get some extra little baby butterflies too. I'm loving butterflies at the moment. I'm not going to lie to you. I also look like I've been doing some crazy scientist work because I've been, <laughs> I've just been doing a try on all my stories of the in the style range for everyone. Here he is. Done with your tips. Tips of the day done. Girlfriend, you got me smiling brighter each day Stars are brighter, I feel lighter in every way Girlfriend, there's no one like you when it comes to loving Life is richer, lips are sweeter, now listen Upstairs. I've just made myself some lunch. Blue's coming with. <laughs> and I thought, let me put this down. So I've just made myself my usual chicken, kale, and rice with Nando sauce, and I love it. So simple, but so quick and just really nice. And I've actually got myself a, um, a vitamin C drink because I'm feeling not that great today. I'm a bit coldy and bad throaty since Prague. I just think I'm a bit under the weather. I'm not really sleeping that well either, but um, it's all good in the hood anyway. I thought because it's kind of been a while since I showed you my dressing room and it's probably the most done room in the house. It's not finished, but it's almost there. There is still some little things I want to change, but I just want to show you how it's doing so far and I thought I'd just show you where some bits are from. Sometimes you guys ask in the comments when I'm just like passing, so I thought it'd be good. So I'm going to turn you around and stop, stop showing you my face because I look a bit of a mess. I just had my hair up like this for the shower because I didn't want it to get wet. So excuse me, <laughs> but let me turn you around. So when you walk in, my plant is looking sad. I need to remove that branch, I think, and give him a water. But when you walk in, we have the cute little sign. So I don't know if you remember this. I got this from A Aous Neon, which is an Instagram as A-O-O-S. I'll link them below, but um, they had so many different ones and I just loved that it says life is beautiful because I feel like sometimes we need to be reminded when we're having rubbish days that life is actually beautiful. You have that when you come in. I was initially thinking I was gonna put it above the mirror but then me and Niall thought it was a little bit busy if we did that and it's just a nice little welcome into the room, isn't it? So, this is how we're looking. I actually, do you know what I really want to do because I do somewhere have videos of this room before so maybe I'll slot them in. I'm not very good at like doing cool video editing but 
This room was a little boy's room and it was covered in spaceships and little glow-in-the-dark stars which is so cute but it was very much a little boy's room and um, we had to completely transform it so it's really cool and it's all thanks to my interior designer Sean Bly. I always link her in the description box but she has just been amazing at helping me put things together because I knew what I wanted but I feel like with interior if you don't have much experience because I didn't really have any, this is my first house and I know what I like, but I feel like I need somebody to help me visualise it all together, if you get me. And she was so good. She designed this walk-in wardrobe for me, so I wanted it all to be open so you could see the clothes. I think it looks nice and it gives the room colour, because obviously I do wear a lot of colour. This was all co colour coordinated before, but it's got a little bit messy. I'm going to have a sort out soon, I think, to make it all nice again. So I've got my tops, I've got my jumpers, I've got some coats there. Oh, I love this. I haven't worn this enough yet. It's my princess jumper from Zara. I flipping love Disney clothes. Just love them. And then we've got some dresses here. Very sparkly. And then we've got some shoes and bags. And some shoes and bags. <laughs> it's so cool having this little area. I feel like such a snazz pop. But yeah, this was all built by Sharps, which I actually would not recommend. <laughs> I know that's funny, but lots of you have said to me, and I haven't ever said because it was quite a mission when it happened to get it right. And in general, they were good, but um, the design we had, they didn't follow exactly it on the day. So it was all a bit of a shambles, but it's fine. I still think it looks lovely. We were basically going to have like a open curved rail here instead but then last minute even though they had approved it they said they couldn't I don't know it's all a bit I didn't really understand <laughs> yeah it's fine I, I love this bit too so I got these little baskets from home sense and it adds a little bit of like country vibe because I didn't want it to be too white I'm not really into white interior personally I know you can probably get stuff like this from Ikea but I wanted it built into the wall so if you look it's all like completely seamless which is good so moving on to my dressing table this one's from Maison's de Monde. It's so lovely. I love this. Look at this. Whoa! Hair accessories! So I've got my scrunchies in here. Do you know what? Never showed you this. My mum got me this for Christmas. How cool is this? It's an upcycled scrunchie. A Gucci one. Now, obviously, I mean, I don't own anything Gucci, but this is like a little boutique that upcycles old Gucci things to make little accessories. So it was quite expensive for a scrunchie, but nowhere near the price of Gucci. But it is actually real Gucci material, which I think is so cool. It's got some headbands, we've got some jewellery, and then I thought this little basket, I love baskets. This basket's also from Home Sense. All of them are, I've got some over there too, which I didn't really know what to do with that little cove. But we put those little baskets there and, and Sharps built in that layer. So I've got my undies and stuff hidden away in the corner. Yeah, I think baskets are great if you want to like, I don't know what the word is that I want, like homelify a room. Is that the right word? I can't think of the word. Um, and then we've got this one, which was actually a PR package ages and ages ago that I kept. It came in this box. It's like a picnic box, which is I just think is a really nice piece of decor as well. But all my hair stuff's in there. And then we've got this little setup here, which I think's cute. These little candles are from Nile, actually. For Christmas, they got me these from the White Company. They smell insane. And then this is actually so handy. This little mirror is from H&M Home. You may remember me getting this, actually, ages and ages ago. <laughs> it must have been, like, I don't even know, seven, eight months ago, way before we moved in, that I just thought it would be cute. And it's really handy, actually, because I've got all my favourite earrings here. And then the mirror is from Wayfair. This lovely wallpaper, which is still not quite right, is from um, Murals Wallpaper. But because this room is on a slant, this happened, which nobody else usually sees, but I just showed you, which I probably shouldn't have. <laughs> These were also built in when I had the wardrobe built in. If you can see, they're completely seamless, which is so lovely. I actually don't know what to do with this area yet, so if you have any ideas, I basically... I'm thinking, if I get some sort of wood shelving to put in, I think that would look nice, do you think? Not sure. Look at this. This reminds me every morning. Blue in the sky means no blue in the brain, but even when it's grey outside, there's blue beyond the clouds. <laughs> I said that in such a sassy way then. I was thinking it today though, because it is so grey today. But there's still blue beyond that somewhere. We just can't see it at all today. But yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do exactly with this area yet. It's just all a little bit 
mismatch at the moment. I've got my little in the style thing, which I think is quite vain of me. <laughs> All my friends were like, Megan, you have to have one in your dressing room because it's such like a moment. Um, but I still feel a little bit, don't know. <laughs> Vein. And then this lovely painting was from someone that sent me it to my P.O. box of Bluebell, which is so nice. Oh look, Blue's in here. Didn't even realise you were here still. You okay, Bab? How you doing? Do you like the dressing room? I think she does. This sofa is from Maison de Monde also. It is a sofa bed, which we got in case, you know, like last resort. If we were having quite a few guests, they could stay in here because we do have the spare rooms. Apparently it's not the most comfortable sofa bed in the world. Someone told me over Christmas, but it'll do. And then the pillows are H&M home, almost all the pillows in the house are, and that throw is. This little mirror's from Made, which I actually had to measure out quite carefully because it was quite a complicated area to get. But I love it, I really like the black framing. And then these lovely lights which have come with me for years to all my different rooms are from Festive Lights. They're the copper wire ones, they're really good because they're just like, you can bend them round. I think they're just, I just know, I just love them. They're, I mean, they've come with me for years. I think they're just an iconic thing in my house, really, aren't they? <laughs> so yeah, that's how my dressing room's looking at the moment. Let's do a little overview. Oh, that's a little bit of a shambles though. I need to do something about that. If you have any ideas of like, I don't know, there's just not, not enough storage in here, so I might have to move the coats elsewhere. Let's carry on our pan. There's blue. <laughs> I love that beam so much. And also actually we had these spotlights fitted in because this room was so dark. And obviously there's not that much natural light which isn't ideal for makeup but luckily I'm not a huge makeup fanatic so it doesn't bother me that much. Although I may eventually get some lights to go around this mirror because it's probably the worst possible makeup lighting ever. Look at that down light, you literally can't see any Thing you need to see. Yes, that's my little dressing room so far. I absolutely love it. It's just crazy to me that I actually have one. I never ever thought I'd have a dressing room, but um, luckily we don't have too many kids yet. <laughs> but when we do have too many kids, I'm gonna have to lose it, but it'll be worth it for a child. <laughs> but yeah, I love it. I think it's so cool. And it's, I know it's small, but I think it's perfect for me. And it's just nice to have a girl's room. Where no boys are allowed. <laughs> no joking. That does come in here, but he doesn't really spend any time in here. Just me and Blue, and it blue, and Pop sometimes too. Sometimes they have fights in this room. <laughs> oh, also this chair is from Maison's de Monde too, um, but it's actually a garden chair. But I just really liked it. There we go. Anyway, I'm going to eat my food because it's probably gone cold now, so I'm going to probably have to microwave it, and then I need to get on with some work, and I'll probably catch up with you in a bit because I think. No, we'll, we'll talk about it in a bit. Do you want to go fur walk? Do you want to go fur walk? Do you want to go to the woods? Or do you want to go to the common? Do you want to go fur walk to the woods? <laughs> I'm going to play this game with it. Okay, we're going to pick where we're going to go for a walk, okay? Do you want to go to the woods? Or do you want to go to the common? Push your nose nearer the one you want. Woods or common? Oh, she went for the woods. <laughs> We're gonna go to the woods, woohoo! Oh, so cute. Niall was just making fun of me because my outfit's quite funny. We're on the dog walk. It's the two-tone teddy bear. That's what's I'm like a giant teddy. Not a care in the world. For launch day, I'm dedicated. Yeah. Absolutely everything I'm wearing. I've got the crop top, I've got the jumper, I've got the coat, I've got the trackies and I look like a massive marshmallow. This forest is looking slightly spooky though, I have to say. Look at that field now, it's a big smoky blur. It's a bit of a horror film setting this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm a bit freaked yeah, out. Grabby dabby dab in a Chinese laundry. <laughs> so grabby dabby dab what? <laughs> What's that from? Like what my dad used to sing to me when he washed me in the bath. Was it? Yeah. Mm, big yawn. <laughs> right in the lens. You watching Dumbo Blue? <laughs> She's actually watching Dumbo. Good evening, everybody. Me and Blue are currently watching Dumbo and she is intrigued. Do you like elephants, Blue? 
Me too. Just set up the house all nice and cosy. Got some candles on. I swear I put another one on, but maybe it was just those two. And um, I'm actually just about to make some of my banana bread. So I make this very often, I know, but it's literally my favorite and it just makes me feel really cozy. And it was just such a gloomy day today. So I feel like it'll be nice to do. So I've popped out all the ingredients. So it's quite simple. We haven't got too much. I like to put some chocolate chips in mine as well. So I'm gonna do that and yeah. Basically, I'm gonna make some banana bread because I feel like it'll make me feel homely and comfy this evening on a Wednesday gloomy evening. So I'm gonna pop you on the side. I will put the recipe in the description box if you do want to follow it. It's the one I always do. I don't actually know where I got the recipe from, but I think it's the best banana bread. So I'm gonna pop you down and get baking. She stands by the window, stares out the She hopes for a clear view before the day is done. What can you do when you head over heels in love? Be mine, da 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 da. Into the oven. It's the moment of truth. Oh, look at that. Niall, come look at this. I'm gonna take him some. See what you think of this. Go on, have a taste. Do you have to have it all? I'll have it. It's warm. Give it a blow. <laughs> I haven't tasted it yet, so I don't know if it's... A... <laughs> Give it another blow. <laughs> Is it good? <laughs> Do the... Mmm. <laughs> Right, let me give it a taste and I'll let you know. Oh yeah, that's a good one. I think it's my best yet. Bedtime hugs. Bedtime hugs with you and bedtime hugs with you. She ran out and then she quickly changed her mind, tried to get back in. Oh, she's been cuddling me so much today. Look, she's coming to sit. I didn't even persuade her. Poppy's the OG, Bluebell. The original gangster. <laughs> She's going to see us have She's the kids. Probably. Aggressive gangster. Aggressive. <laughs> She's the ogre. No, this is our new nighttime routine. You like a hug, don't you? <laughs> Good morning, everybody. And welcome, not to another video. It's the next morning. Please excuse me. My brain's in starting a new vlog mode, but um, oh, I'm just whapping in my car because I'm rushing off to London this morning. I thought I'd say good morning. I haven't got all that much time, so I just want to say a little hello. But basically, I'm just heading to London because today I have a day full of meetings. I've got some very exciting ones. Some I can probably show you. I'm hoping, that's why I wanted to vlog today as well. Because I'm hoping I can give you some sneak peeks of some things coming. Yeah, oh, hang on BBC Surrey, we're not even in Surrey. But yeah, hopefully one of the meters I'll be able to show you some stuff. I've got a big rather peachy meeting basically. So I'm hoping I could show you some of the, maybe some sneak peeks of the designs coming because we've got lots of collections planned throughout the year. But then the other two are just two, probably biggest things I've ever worked on coming, but they're, get, they're gonna be a while till they come out. So I probably won't be able to show you much. But anyway, I know that's annoying, but I just wanted to show you some rather peachy bits. And um, yeah, and Niall's actually coming into London later with Bluebell. He's got a few things to do, so I'm gonna meet him and we're probably gonna have a late lunch, hopefully. So I'll probably bring you to that too, but I need to go, because I'm gonna be late. Oh, let me just show you my outfit actually, because I like it. I feel a bit edgy, I feel a bit indie. That's what I feel. So I've got my In The Style jeans on that I've just launched. Also, thank you so much everybody that um, supported the launch yesterday. I didn't, I didn't speak to you after it went live. So um, yeah, thank you so much everybody that supported it. You are the best, and if you want to grab anything, I'll leave the link in the description box below. Um, but yeah, I've got the jeans on, and then I've got this new polo neck on from Brandy Melville. It's not cropped, but it, it's not long, so I like it. And then this coat's an oldie from I Am Gia. Never heard of that place until I bought this, but yeah, that's the outfit. Anyway, I'm gonna head off. I'm not too late, but I'm gonna head off, and I shall see you, hopefully, to give you a sneak peek. We'll see. Oh, I love them. 
I just, remember. Yeah, I just had like. Yeah, yeah okay. I can show you. This is our recycled polyester, which we had used before for men. And this is organic cotton again from Turkey. That's nice. Uh huh. Oh, not sure about this one. No, it seems a bit more like. It's a bit rigid. Yeah. Yeah. I like this one though. But would this, oh this, would this be the comfy collection? I feel. Or, and can we put them across? Yeah, if you wanted to. Why? Well, I mean, I'd love for it all to be. I can see a little bluey. Hi, Blue. Can you see me? Oh, come, Blue. Your lead's gonna stop. <laughs> hey, baby girl. How you been? You been at Daddy's haircut with? Oh, she just licked the lens. Blue Val. Oh, let's see your haircut. Looking snazz. Oh, it looks really nice. I love it. Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. Oh, you look cute. Give me a hug. Hello, everyone. I haven't shown my face since this morning at like 8 a.m. Good morning. No, not good morning. Good afternoon. Where are we going to eat then? Meetings I'm are done. How was it? It was good, but lots of my brain's a bit like of a schnazzle. Because I did a lot of chatting about future product, products. Projects. 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 Which um, will include products. <laughs> no, not no? necessarily. Um, where are we going to eat then? Anyway, we're going to go find somewhere for lunch. I'm starving, we so we've eat? come to Comet Garden to have some lunch. I don't know, the, I like the little square bit. There's a magician. He put a balloon in his mouth, so it was a long one. I was like, how did you do that, hen? He pulls it out from his sleeve for me. Anyway, we've come to Comet Garden for some lunch. So we're going to find somewhere that is bluebell friendly. But I just want to show you how cute it is. It's going to be quite cold, isn't it? I have a heater. Is the magician doing his thing, eating balloons. It's like the cutest part of London, really, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. I love it. Anyway, we're going to find somewhere for lunch in here. Are we? Okay. And I'll show you what we get. Oh, 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 look at my lunch. So I have a vegan chilli. Bluebell wants some, but she can't. And Niall has... Is it an open sandwich? Is that what it's called? Basically, yeah, tartine. Tartine. Madame. Looks lovely, and so does mine. In a little outdoor area in Covent Garden. It's called La Panda Quatidon, which is probably really badly said. How do you say it? Uh, <laughs> there we go. Where's the flipping? Where's the name? There it is, that one. Oh, oh, there we go. We're there. And the food looks lovely, and we've got a heater, so. It's for a story. I feel like we're, it's Christmas, but it's not. Come on, sir, tell him what you just said. No. Can you show, let me just see your haircut again, because it looks so nice. Who else thinks that it looks so nice like this? Like, turn to the we're side. Get it cut oh, it looks so nice well, like that. To to get it cut. I'm not you look so to snazzy. Everyone, no. Like you do for your beauty treatments. Actually, ooh, I'm really zoomed. That's what you do. No, I get my hair done every six months. Basically, no, you don't. You're in glow every other eyelashes. Week. Yeah, exactly. That's what eyelashes. I mean. And your nails. All right, it's not about me. I'm talking about you. I was just saying, you've got really nice hair. You don't have to attack me. I know, but as I said, I just feel like a bit of a fuck boy. <laughs> fuck boy. Yeah. Uh, you look like. Oh, there's the fuck boy again. <laughs> With the big brows. It is. This part is just fun, really. I like that. Over. That part is. <laughs> fuck boy yeah, back of the head. Boy, like. <laughs> Look what I'm about to watch. It's Riverdale. It literally hasn't been on for like. Is it two months or is that dramatic? It had a mid season break. And I'm very excited because this came to Netflix this morning. And I've only just obviously got time to watch it. So I'm. I'm living my best life. I've got some of my banana cake bread. I can't speak. I'm gonna watch it. I'm so excited. I've missed I've missed Jughead so much. Don't know about you. Anyone else? We miss Jughead because I have. Love a bit of Cole Sprouse. Do you wanna come join me, Blue? Come here. Come on. Come on. Oh, she's tired from her day in London. Forgot what it's like to be a city dog, aren't you, Blue? Anyway, I think I'm actually going to call this vlog a day here because I feel like we've got quite a lot of footage and I don't want it to get too long. I was going to bring you tomorrow to London again, but then I thought, you know, we're going to London again 
and the, the same thing will probably happen again where I don't actually get that much footage. So I think I'm going to love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you see in the next one. I'm trying to think what the next one is going to be. I'm not sure. Oh, no, that's not going to be the next one. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna do a week of workout soon. I might actually film that throughout next week because it's Thursday today, so I'm gonna start on Monday. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe that'll be the next one. If it's not the next one, it'll be the one after. I think I'm gonna do that, so hopefully see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and please do like and give me a subscribe if you did like it because it really does help. Like, liking a video helps with the stats. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying there.